Hi, this is William Lamb, Senior Technical Marketing Engineer at VMware. And my name is Alan Renouf, Senior Technical Marketing Architect at VMware. We're first going to start by creating an alarm at the cluster level. So go ahead and click on New Alarm. We'll give this new alarm a new name called Secure VM, and we're going to monitor the virtual machine for a specific event. Then go ahead and click on the triggers, and we're going to create a trigger based on a VM being created. Next, we need to create an action for the VM creation, and we're going to send and run a command. Here, we're going to specify the Perl script that's going to execute on the vCenter server. Go ahead and click OK. Now we go to the alarm section, and we can confirm that we've created the new secure VM trigger. Now we'll go ahead and confirm the alarm by creating a new VM. After the VM has been created, we'll go over to the task and alarms to take a look to confirm that the alarm has been triggered. Here you can see that the alarm has been executed, but we can see that there's a reconfiguration of the virtual machine, and within the task and events, we can see that our Pro script has been executed. We'll go back to the virtual machine, and let's confirm that the settings have been applied. As you can see, the security hardening guys that we wanted to configure for this particular VM has been applied on this VM. If we go back to our input file, we can see that these are the same exact settings. So now we're going to delete this virtual machine and we'll show you how we would do exactly the same thing but with a PowerShell script. We'll just edit the existing alarm that we have at the moment. We'll change the script that it runs so that it runs the PowerShell version of the batch file. And again, we'll create another virtual machine. Once the virtual machine has been created, we can see that our alarm has been triggered. So let's go back into that virtual machine and again check the settings to make sure that they applied. You can see our security hardening settings have automatically been applied to this virtual machine. During this demonstration you have seen how vCenter alarms can be used to kick off scripts which can automate the hardening of your virtual machines.